Today marks the start of our month of a million meals campaign. Last year, Feeding San Diego distributed more than 40 million meals. Our ABC tennis reporter Sophia Hernandez shows how something as simple as food changed one Escondido family's lives for the better. The moment you step into the Dagrett household, they seem like your everyday family. But if you looked at someone like me and my children, you would have no idea. A pandemic, divorce, this mother who had been homeschooling her children, now their sole caretaker. You feel like you failed. You feel like um, you're supposed to fix it all. And the truth is my job was to be there for my kids. The kids learning slowly, a home cooked meal was becoming a rarity. The food habits were not good because we would be before we would be eating out every single meal. So first of all, it costs a lot and it was really unhealthy. And if we weren't, it would be just little snacks throughout the day and not full meals. An empty fridge was the turning point for Carlin, who found feeding San Diego through social media. And I was like, oh, I wonder if I'm allowed to go because we could use food. Her kids at first hesitant to the idea. I didn't want to go because to me that's kind of embarrassing to the point where you have to get food from someone else. But the difference they found with feeding San Diego versus other food banks is that it was families just like theirs in line two. That gave me comfort, you know, that people, there's people all over just like me that that need this help. It, the way it was done was professional and it was just very sincere. It was just them trying to help and that was really great. Seeing other like kids and like families that seem like they're okay, but then there's all like obviously people go through situations and don't look it. So to know that there is like people out there that don't just judge from the outside was comforting. The bonus, the food they were given. This is actually good food and we made like a really great dinner and everything. It was like the food's actually good. And now we actually have a snack cabinet, which we all love. Almost two years later, the Dagrits are back to school, starting new jobs, feeling a newfound energy from nutritious foods. I would say just a good meal probably helped with um, uh, with um, with that. And today I'm doing much, much better. I'd say I'm happier than I have been. Made me a lot more productive and made me have a lot more energy. Just It just made me happier. Closer than ever before, thanks to a new kind of dinner time. I would say we bonded a lot more at the because we actually sat and talked to each other for quite a while and it would just be a lot it's a lot nicer now saying thank you to those who give of their time and money to help put food on this table thank you for doing this you don't have to do this of course but they chose to they chose to help you're not just giving food you're giving people hope you're giving people encouragement and to me like that was the biggest part of it is to know that 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 was out there for me too. Sophia Hernandez, ABC 10 News. And you can make a difference by supporting Feeding San Diego's critical work by donating to the Month of a Million Meals campaign. To do that, just go to 10news.com and click on Month of a Million Meals.